What is up beautiful people? Welcome back to my channel. Today I wanted to talk about how to grow your Pinterest account optimizing your Pinterest profile. Let's talk social media, shall we? Okay, let make sure I get the coffee. My hands are full and we are back in business. So if you're here, it's because you want to know how to grow your Pinterest account, optimizing your Pinterest profile. So let's get into it. I've decided to film this video because my Pinterest account has been growing like crazy those couple of weeks. And I thought it would be great to share my secrets with you for you to optimize your profile and grow your own Pinterest account. Okay guys, so I am actually sharing my screen and you guys can follow my analytics with me. So as you can see here, my impression, we almost a million people seeing my pin. It's the number of times your pins were seen. Total audience, we almost have a million too. My engagement, 32,000. And engaged audience, 27,000. So the engagement, the total number of engagements on your pins, including saves, close up, link link, and carousel swipes. That means that people interacted with the pins. So it's like 32,000 people were interacted over a million. That's good. And the engaged audience, the number of people who engage with your pins. All right, so let's Let's see what happens if we change the date range. Let's see the last 60 days. April 3rd to May 29, I got a million point zero four impressions on my pins. The thing that I love to do to make sure my Pinterest account is actually working well, this is great to have like a million impressions on your pins, but it doesn't mean anything if the pins you're sharing are not driving traffic to your Instagram account or your YouTube channel or your website, your blog. So what I love to look at really is the link clicks and as well as how many people saves my pins. On these metrics, you can say that the total of pins saving is 3,641, which is not that bad. And the link clicks, it's about 1,850, so almost 2,000 link links. And this number keeps on growing and this is what you want for your Pinterest account. You want to use Pinterest to drive traffic to your website. There are a lot of things you need to consider for your Pinterest account to grow and for your pins to be seen. So the first thing you need to do is optimizing your Pinterest profile or SEO. Why? Because Pinterest is first of all a search engine. You're going on Pinterest like you're going on YouTube to looking for answers. So you need to optimize your Pinterest profile thinking of some that will look for something and that they will find you. Example, you are a fitness guru and want to bring traffic from Pinterest to your YouTube channel because you are doing workout videos, right? Then you have to optimize your profile. Everything about fitness, to working out, tutorial videos, how to work out or whatever is the thing that you provide. Your entire profile need to show Fitness. Now that you understand why you need to optimize your Pinterest profile, I'm going to tell you what you need to do. First, you need to make sure that your Pinterest account is a business account, not a personal account. You cannot grow a personal account. You need to grow a business account. It's totally free. You just need to change a couple of settings. I actually have a blog post where I talk about how to switch from a personal to a business account on my website if you want to check that out. And when you did that, we can get started. Take a look to my Pinterest profile. As you can see, my board cover, this is the pin I made that drives traffic to my website. This is not a pin for someone else that brings traffic to other people's website. Then there is my profile picture. So this is the logo of my business. I'm all about social media and content creation. So right away, it tells you who am I and what I do. I also left my email, my website that I claimed in the settings. And as you can see on my name, I put Justine Lamer but I added what I do. Keywords. I bet that if you hear, and this is not the first video that you see, you have heard search engine optimization and keyword everywhere. I am not here to teach you what is search engine optimization and I am not here to teach you what is keywords, but if you have a little bit of sense, you will understand. Here on my profile, you can see that I put my name. I also added social media consultant as well as content 
creator. Meaning that when people are going to tap on the search bar for people, social media consultant, they are going to find me. I am here, okay? Don't be scared if you don't have any followers or if your following is really low. Pinterest is a search engine. It's also a social media platform, but first of all, this is a search engine. No one cares how many followers you got on Pinterest. The thing that you care about with Pinterest is bringing traffic to your other platforms. Let's recap quick. First, business account, your website, YouTube, Instagram, everything you need to claim. Second, use your pins as a cover of your Pinterest profile. Upload a really good quality profile picture that show yourself or your brand, like your logo. Here we are on edit profiles. So for your display name, as I say, you can put your name. So me will be Justine Lamer. I am a social media consultant and a content creator. So this is the keyword that I'm choosing to target. Uh, use a username that you use on every other platforms for people to be able to find you. I had to choose Justine Lamer with two I because Justine Lamer was already taken. To optimize the about your profile, you will need to describe what you do using keywords. So for my profile, I said how to create unique content, social media and content creation tips grow your social media with my online services because I am offering social media services on my website so I need to talk about them and so the keywords that I targeting are creating content social media content creation tips and so as I use fitness as an example earlier if my account was all about fitness and working out I would say Justine Lamer fitness and workout videos for my display name or like workout guru and healthy recipe like I will target those keywords and about your profile I would write workout tips fitness tips a video tutorial how to work out that when people are going to looking for workout tutorials or video about working out they will find my content then obviously don't forget to put your email if people wants to contact you and now you need to start creating boards that makes sense let me explain if you optimize your profile to be a social media consultant and a content creator but you are creating boards about healthy food and traveling in japan you are making pinterest confuse they need to be in relation with what your profile is all about. So if you're creating this fitness Pinterest profile, you will need to create board about fitness and healthy food because that will make sense, all right? Mine is all about social media and content creation. So I have boards about branding, about photography for beginner, about uh, Instagram story stickers, Instagram story IDs, how to edit picture, creative photography IDs, social media strategies, marketing tools and tips, business tips, blogging tips, Instagram tips, and more. Pinterest profile need to make sense from the beginning to the end. All right, guys, this is a lot of talking. You know, I usually don't talk that much. I usually edit pictures. I'm thirsty! There are tons of other things that you can do to grow your Pinterest account that I have not go through. But I cannot share all my secrets yet. Trust me, it works. Use Soma Analytics, okay? I'm not kidding. Also, as I say, there is other secrets. You need to work on your Pinterest. You need to pin a lot. The right pins, not every pins, the right one. I will give more secrets soon, so stay tuned. If you like this video and if you actually learned something today, give me a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe to never miss any social media tips. And I will see you next time. Bro, you Pinterest. And to do so, we need to go in my office because this lightning, guys.